the face already show West Coast and East Coast here. This is like like Brand is cool is like so West Coast the face, and Art is like so East Coast. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Just how they're dressed, and their style. But these guys are both very good. I've had the fortune of playing both of them in Street Fighter V. They are both great, great, great players. So we have Arturo against Brad is cool. Thousand and another Ken. Let's see how Brad told me he actually actually don't like this matchup a lot because it's quite hard against him. Right. And uh, let's see. Ken does have some Round tricks he one. can do. Fight. Okay. That standing roundhouse across the fireball. Mm -hmm. That fierce and the great life too. Yeah, so that crouching fierce is uh, upper uh, upper body invincibility to okay. fireballs. So whenever he sees a fireball, he can go for that. Okay. I like how every player jump on Thousand. Thousand is just too sly and just across to the other yeah. side. Yeah, I feel like neutral jump is a little bit better because then he can't really slide under you too easy. That's not safe, and uh, Art is like reading that. Yeah. Easy the round the best thing right now you cannot easily um, pressure Sim is because his his standing jab is very good right now. This is hard to pressure Sim. B skill setup that was nice. Go to the other side, another instant gal. There's no instant gal. I think the mix up right there is like he do the first instant gal and then he think he do another instant gal in the front side, but instead of that he teleport to the other side and do. Roundhouse uh, combo. Good punish on the Visco. Nice jab. Yep. And that jab is so active too. It's cheap. That's the only way I can say it. Missed the punish on the sweep. Activate. He went low. That was nice. Another setup. Nice, nice Jimmy. Jimmy. Nice grab. One more will do it. Overhead. Oh, go for the overhead. Wow, very. Smooth attack style by Ken right there. It's like classic West style over there. I can tell. Yeah, that probably was go for hundred times with Julio. That's just supposed to set play like that. I really like how perfectly they're both playing the matchup. Whenever Brent is close, his mix-ups are. That mix-up is too cheap. Yep. Oh my god! Oh, he combo. missed the combo by Arturo Sanchez. And Brent has a chance to come back. He has a V trigger ready. V trigger combo right now. It will be almost even. Oh, nice I like the entire a lot. Again, got the jump in. Knocked down. Any hit is V-Trigger right now. He has to watch out. Oh, You see that low, so low forward run? It's like he can do standing jumps very fast. V-Trigger. Someone told me uh, for low forward uh, V-Trigger fire, fire uh, land, right? Uh -huh. he, he can do V-Reversal. The V-Skill will not uh, assist in the, in the ground if you do between of them. Hmm. This is the third win. Alright, so I throws up the first game. Yes. Brent? Brent was looking good. He definitely picked some spots. So it looks like Arturo will say, um, let's let, let, let him get in front of me and push me in the corner. I don't know how to deal with those mix up though. Let's see how Arturo Sanchez does. And Brent's how to adjust. Nice entire air by Arc. Still trying to get in. And 5 0 VD is not helping right now. No. No go on the jump in. He's trying so hard to get in on Arturo, but Arturo is spacing everything perfectly. Crush counter, setup. Wow, that was Yo, tricky. Those setup is so tricky because you think, you think he would do a standing fierce, which is he already land and do a standing jet. Nice. Cross under. Nice, nice mix up. He almost get a stun over there. Oh, he didn't do one stop kill oh, over there. I don't even. Oh my god. V trigger. Get out of the flames, man. Get out of the flames. Go for Good overhead. Block. Okay. Oh. Um, he tried to wait until he yes. landed to get a real combo. He did it only a tiny bit too early. Good punish. That was nice. You see the pure punish if you can punish a slide like that? Uh -huh. I think only could be low shot though. A low strong can be done too. 
I'm not sure. It uh, depends on how close he yes. does it, I think. But even so, most of the time he's minus when that happens. So yes. you if you you usually should press a button because if yes. not, he'll go for throw yes. or he'll go for sand. Uh, usually only Vilas could be through low shot combo, something like that. <laughs> this time he challenged it. Slide V trigger again, this is bad. EX sure you nope. that's it. Man. Looks very hard for Cam. Though, for yeah, that looks tough. And it's not like Brent didn't play well. No. Whenever he got close to Dawson, his mix-ups were very yes. effective. He definitely yes. was hitting everything that he tried. So but. top 16 already make it to top 8 for all the winners. Make it to top 8. Yep. All right, so we're going to be doing loser side now, it sounds like. See if we can get it up. Oh, nice, we got an updated bracket for you guys at home. So... We just saw... Oh, wow. So Julio is going to fight Arturo. Another Ken versus Dawson matchup. And Filipino champ is going to fight Eli Joe's Nash. Okay. And Eli Joe does happen to have a lot of good experience against Arturo. And I'm talking about top-level tournaments. Top three yes, winners yes. finals. This is when they're fighting. So yes. I think that champ should, should definitely tread carefully against him. Loser sides. Uh, 3K has to fight Shin Lad. That's coming soon. Blood versus CD Manny. Looks like we're looking for the players right now, guys. All right, guys, if you are in the stream and you know 3K, if you're his friend and you're watching the stream in the hotel room or something like that, please tell 3K to come downstairs right now. He's supposed to play his match. We don't want to disqualify him, especially when he's in top six, uh, top 16 still. Definitely want to give him a chance. All right. Let's say we're going to do the next match first. Okay. Well, while we wait, guys, I want to give some love to our sponsors real quick. Uh, please check out Dynamic Custom Beatworks at dynamicbeatworks.com. These guys are the number one in uh, custom and pre-made Perla sprites. They are officially licensed by Capcom, so go get all your Street Fighter V stuff right now, your Luras, your Karens, uh, whatever else you like. Use the code Philly is free for 25% uh, off your purchase. Also want to give out to the Steam company. We got the Steam Co's CD Jr. about to play in just a minute. Uh, they sponsor some of your favorite players, but they also sell some delicious, delicious e-liquid for you. 25% off using the code WINNERBRO16 at thesteamcode.com. Also want to get off to Clutch It Out. Please check them out at clutchedout.com. You can use their promo code CUSTOMBOYS to get 10% off all their orders, 50% or more, or $50 or more, sorry, clutchedout.com. Thank you so much. We have LUT against CD Jr. in the loser final. Not loser final, loser bracket, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. Lud's representing CoinUp. CD Jr. is representing the Steam company. So Lud, a uh, very good Chun-Li, but he says, unfortunately, he does not have a PS4 yet, so he doesn't own a copy of Street Fighter Understand. V. Understand, yeah. so he only can go up to the CoinUp store and play Street Fighter yeah, exactly. V. Exactly, he plays at his friend's house, I think, and then he also has played at a couple events. But he says that although the game is out for like two weeks now, he only has about one week of real experience with the game. Understand. But Lud is like fundamental guy too, like he played like very, very...